Dear. Hello and welcome to What's for Dinner, where we make delicious meals in, oh, you know, about 30 minutes or so. Yeah. And today it's a barbecue day, so that's right on. Who are you? I am Mary Jo Eustace Caustic. No, you're not. Yes, I am. Don't, you know what? Please people... make me validate this. No. <laughs> people think that. Do you know, people come up to me and ask me if you're my wife. Mrs. Caustic. I think it rolls off the tongue, don't you? <laughs> what are you making? I'm making a seafood grill with lemon wedges Ooh. and Ooh. Uh, fresh <laughs> vegetables. Lemon wedges. Ooh. Yeah. And are you doing and fresh vegetables? And yeah. I'm doing it on metal skewers today. Yeah, I think that's a really good idea. Had a problem really with those wooden idea. ones the other day? You broke them with yeah. your with your shear boot strength. Right? You know why? Because yeah. I'm macho. You're so macho. I'm doing a streamer salad, which has got jicama in it, which is a Mexican fruit vegetable type mix, like water, Ooh. chestnut, a bit of apple. Ooh. And I'm going to do that with a coconut milk dressing and some Ooh. peanuts. Can I say something to you? Yes, you may. You look lovely. Do I really? In that whatever you have on. It's a shift. It's a shift. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. It looks beautiful. Well, there's on a you. bit of a role reversal. You're a bit macho, and I'm yeah. a bit fruity. Yeah. Who knew? Hey. Who knew? Things can change on what's for dinner. If the like pop that. fits, wear it. That's yeah. what I said. After say. the break, we're okay. going to be doing a little macho fruity thing. We are. Yeah. See you in a minute. And welcome back to What's for Dinner, Ooh. where I'm doing a wonderful seafood grill with vegetables and fresh herbs and lemon. Oh, that sounds yes. really nice. So I'm going to go to the fridge, get my seafood, cube it up, and start to marinate it. Mama, what do you do? Mama, baby. Oh, are, are you not going to uh, marinate your vegetables? No. That's a bit personal. No. Nope. No? Okay, well, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get all my jicama. Look, at that's a big jicama, quite oh. frankly, Shirley, don't you think? Yeah. So... What I'm going to do is I'm going to cut it in half, and then I'm going to, oh, my God. And then I'm going to peel it. Then I'm going to... You know, I think that you should be talking to us more about jicama, because this is... Can you buy this in your local supermarket? Yes, you can get this at okay. your local supermarket sometimes during yes. the year. Maybe not all the time, but it might be worth going to a specialty store for. But sometimes you can get it at the local grocery. Okay, that's and it's good. sort of got a texture between a potato and a water chestnut and an apple, but it's really delicious. Oh. I'm going to give you a little slice. Okay, what does it smell like? What does I've it never smell had like? jicama. Apple. And water chestnut, actually. Have a little bite of roux. Watch the dentures. Oh, it is like apple. Isn't that nice? That is very nice. Oh, <laughs> be, ca <laughs> be careful. What I'm going to, sorry. Oh, God. That's not an expensive t-shirt. What? Don't be don't touching. Don't touch the merch. Don't touch the merch. <laughs> Can I take it back? Now, what I'm going to do is uh, peel this, uh -huh. and I'm going to julienne that. Mm. So I'm actually using, let me just check, about two cups of jicama, and then I'm going to have two cups of oranges segmented, Ooh. and some pepper, and then this coconut dressing. My gosh. Perfect. Don't you think that sounds yummy in your tummy? Yes. Now... I've just peeled, earlier, I peeled my shrimp here. I've got, two, no, I've got two more to do. Yes, you do. Okay. Yeah. And, but you can, here's a really good tip, you can buy them already done. Peel. Oh, that's a really good idea. Yeah. A little yeah. more expensive. Right. But you can get them all done. Now, what, those are shrimps. Yes. How big's a prawn? Uh, a bit bigger. <laughs> how much, that's You want very, any inches? That's or? not very technical. Like, how much bigger would that oh, be? Oh, just a tiny bit. Just a teetsy yeah. Oh, yeah. all right. Okay, and then you could just grill those up as well. You can. Quite lovely. You can. And if you wanted to, oh, I feel a replacement tip coming on. Oh, gosh. If you wanted to. With the swordfish, you mean? No, you could replace the shrimp with... Scallops? Oh. What? Come on. That was mine. <laughs> okay, now I'm going to do... Let's let's do a replacement for the swordfish. You tuna no. might be nice. Stop it. Or tuna might be nice. Oh, you know what? What? I need some credibility on the show. <laughs> You're never going to get any credibility on the show. <laughs> you recognize that, don't you? <laughs> baby, baby, baby. Uh, okay. Yes. Uh, in go the seafood Excellent. into this bowl. Okay. We've got here our wonderful shrimp. Yes. And as we said, you can replace with uh, other things. <laughs> the scallops. Scallops. Might be nice. Tuna. Now listen, Kenny, I know we're going with the seafood thing, White but, wine. but of course you could... Uh, oh, is that from my stash? What? <laughs> yeah. Don't like that. <laughs> Took White that wine. from my private cabinet? Yes. All right. Um, and? Now, would you ever do this with chicken? Would, would that be nice? Uh, the I lemon? would do it. Yes, yeah. I would do it with chicken. And I also, at the same time, Ooh. I probably would add in some orange. Oh. Do chunks of orange. Have you ever... We've grilled orange before. We you know grilled everything is. here on What's for Dinner. Let's be honest. Who are we kidding? Oh, dropped a knife. Not good. Nope. Got to throw some salt over my shoulder. 
We have duck. here some lemon. Oh, jeez. And I'm going to use the juice of two lemons plus a tablespoon of lemon rind. Oh, then you could use limes might be nice. Excellent. Do you have some? Uh, no, sorry. You know what I'm going to do now? What? I'm going back here. I'm bending over. have a joke at my expense. <laughs> oh, my gosh. And I'm going to start to put together my jicama salad. I'm not I've, making what, fun. Baby? I'm not making fun of you. <laughs> yeah, you are. No, I'm How not. How come you're not? Because I was told by a very good friend of mine yes. that pregnant women, when they're having child, <laughs> that they're very sensitive. Or weight gain, let's be honest. You're very, are you sensitive? I am. I feel a bit vulnerable right now. You do. You're not going to cry, are to you? To anybody's charms. Anything could happen. <laughs> no. In your little camp outfit there. <laughs> Don't be scaring me. What Boy Scout did you spill that <laughs> off of? Will you get that looked at? Okay. What is wrong? Okay, what I'm doing here, let's focus. We need, <laughs> we, we need to focus. What I'm oh, doing dear. here. What, what are you I doing? doing? <laughs> I'm chopping up my herbs, my mint, tarragon, some parsley, and I'm mixing that in. Now, here's a really good tip. Oh, right. Gee, oh, What's, oh, okay, oh, go, oh, go, oh, go. I have go. it coming. I have it go, coming. Go, go. If you don't want to use white wine, because, you know, a lot Apple of people. Apple juice might be nice. That's just a suggestion. I oh, am, white oh, grape juice would be really excellent. Perfect. Would perfect. be wonderful. And you know what? We're using some swordfish today. Vermouth which, might be kind of cool, which too. Swordfish is very high in uh, phosphorus, niacin, and vitamin B12. There. Did it. Are you serious? Yeah. Isn't that what Rice Krispies have, too? <laughs> Don't they have all those things as well? Now, th this is a very sad situation here. <laughs> oh, boy. Look. Look what I you're am, reduced to. I have been reduced to chopping with this little paring knife. I know. This is, this is, this Well, you is know what they say. Sad. What? Your knife reflects your personality. <laughs> Let's take a little. look here. <laughs> yeah, no, exactly. Now, I'm just uh, julianning my jicama now, and I'm going to yeah. use a, a couple of cups of uh, jicama, and it's very, very refreshing and right. crunchy. And if you can't get jicama, yes. um, celery might be a really nice replacement, or some water chestnut would oh, be really delicious. I like that idea. Don't you think? I like that idea. Yeah, me too. I can't wait to see what that tastes like. Really? Yes. Oh, you're so with supportive now. Yes. You are so now? supportive. Now? Well, no, ever since I've been with child and it, you know, I mean, you're just very supportive I of me. I am, I am. And it makes me feel better about wearing orthopedic underwear to know that you're right there <laughs> for me. That was a little bit too much information. <laughs> it just makes me, me feel very feminine, oh. your attention. Can I say that? I wear that all the time. <laughs> <laughs> you need to, quite okay. frankly. In goes about half a cup of freshly chopped parsley. All right. Mix that around. Now, how long are you going to marinate this for? One hour. Okay. But this is a half hour show. Right. But normally, you would do it for an hour. And you could also marinate it overnight. Might be uh, pretty pretty cool too. Yes. Yeah. Yes. You know, do it the day and before. And the very good thing about this is, if you wanted to, you can add any other type of fresh herb you want. If you have some leftover basil. Ooh, tarragon would be really nice in the this. Tarragon is in the recipe, dear. Oh, see, I, I never no. read the recipe before we. Okay, tarragon would be excellent. So that's the spice you picked. And you picked. lemon rind, I'm going to put in. Absolutely perfect. Okay. Now, before we go to the break, right? I have a little bit of a trivia no, question. I don't. Yes. Okay. <laughs> oh, I like that. You just, whoa, man. Uh, it's, it's a bit of a shrimp question. Yeah. Because, you know, yeah. in honor of your dish. Um, it's a, it's a two-parter. This, this how is many antennae mm -hmm. does a shrimp have and how many legs does a shrimp have? Oh, I know that. Do you know that? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, what do I get? What do you get? The dress. See okay. in a second. Really? Do you know that? Dear. Welcome back to What's for Dinner. We're having a lot of fun here today, my friend and I, and we're making some very delicious things. I'm doing a jicama salad, a streamer salad, and you are doing something I... that looks magnificent. <laughs> and it's going to get on a skewer soon. Are you going to skewer I found them? some lime. Remember you suggested that? It was beside that? you, baby. It was right beside there. Yes. So I'm using that today. Okay. And I'm going to cut up one lemon, as yes. I said I was going to do. Cut it into wedges and put them on my... Oh, you're going to grill them right on your skewer? Yeah. Now, before you do that, yes. my little friend, I'd like to repeat the trivia question right. for you because you are so going to get this right today, okay? I, I think I am. Okay. Uh -huh. How many antennae do shrimp have and how many pairs of legs? Two and two. <laughs> two and, and two. two. Yeah. Wrong. No. You were wrong. No. They have two antennae and they have five pairs of legs, so they can scurry, 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 scurry. Where did you get that from? Off my trivia card. Off no, my it's trivia correct. card? Yes. I look, can't believe look. you didn't know that. Well, I didn't. Okay, <laughs> get over it. 
You never know them. Okay. Who are we kidding? Look at this. Look at this. In goes a shrimp. I, I got to find a shrimp here. Don't That's know not good. why I bother. There. Look at this skewer. Don't even know why I care about the show. <laughs> Quite frankly. You do. I do. Now what I'm doing is I'm going to cube up some orange segments, a couple of cups to put in my jicama salad. Yes. And then I'm going to julienne my peppers and my apple. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to make the coconut dressing with uh, some honey and sesame oil. So, oh yeah, it's good. You know what? What? Lots you're, of you're talking. Doing, you're doing a lot of talking, babe. I'm doing a lot of talking. Okay. So do you like this dress or do you think it makes me look a bit chunky? No. You know what? I what? think it's very flattering. Is it you. flattering? Yes. Can I ask you a personal question? <laughs> Yes, you it's can. a nice one. Don't okay, worry. Okay. I'm not being nasty. Okay. But is it hard for you to find clothes? Because I'm in with child. <laughs> no, I mean that's a problem. Well, truthfully, I'm yeah. shopping at Big Bold and Beautiful at the moment. But you know, you your size changes. It does it? change how you. So size. do you have to buy new clothes every time your size changes? Well, you get things that are a bit big for you. Yeah. You know, and you sort of grow into them, and then you move on. I used thing. to do that when I was a child. Really? I still do. <laughs> you still do. <laughs> or when you, your weight was up and down like a yo-yo, uh, wasn't it? it? Like you stop. were, you would really gain and then really lose type deal? You know what? It's true, I baby. I said I would be nice. I, because <laughs> women are sensitive. They're, they're very sensitive. So be nice to me. I be was nice very to nice to you. I was, but About I, my weight gain. Or I haven't gained weight, but. No, you have gained weight. But the truth is, I actually like you a bit heavier. Truthfully. No, I really, I really, really do. I, I, I was too thin. I needed to put on some. <laughs> Okay. Who told you that? My doctor. <laughs> they lied. No, you, no, you were very thin. Yeah. You were just emaciated, poor there little guy. There we go. Look at that. Look at Whoa, that. Whoa, Kenny. Look at that. That's a beautiful skewer. I'm working overtime on this. If I do say now, so myself. the one thing I'm doing, the reason I decided to use the lemon. Right. Is to balance the ends. Uh, why, balance so, the ends. So, oh, you are see? you talking aesthetically or weight-wise? Uh, weight-wise, so that uh, the rest of the... Uh, stuff that I'm skewering is in, on the inside. Well, couldn't you just shove a piece of onion on the end? Well, I could, but you know, the onion sometimes falls apart there. Oh, so. I see. Or a nice piece of zucchini, perhaps? Yeah. Well, uh, well, that too. No, they're beautiful skewers. I'm just okay. giving you an absolutely hard time. And you're not going to eat the lemon anyway. No, it's more of like a flavor enhancer, isn't it? Exactly. exactly. Absolutely, sir. There you now, go. I'm just cubing up the orange. Yeah. I'm really off to the races. I think you're really going to like this. It's I, very refreshing. I'm excited. And crunchy. I'm excited. How are your dentures today? Because this is very <laughs> crunchy. Are they good? Yeah, they'll hold. Will they hold yeah, today? I think so. Because you chipped your little tooth. I did chip my tooth. What, on a donut or something? You told me. I can't <laughs> no, remember. I Not on a donut. Look at this. Is this cool? Look at this uh, malleable board, and I'm just going to put my orange slices right in, because you're always complaining that I'm tossing vegetables and uh, fruit on the well, set. Well, it's not me. It's other people that are So I'm just going <laughs> to... Who are the other people? Viewers. Big, brother, big brother's watching you type <laughs> deal. So we're just giving this a stir. A oh, roux. I'll just do it this way. Why don't you just do it that way? Okay. And next, I'm going to add half of my green onions, and then I'm going to save half for garnish, and I'm going to julienne my celery. Oh, oh, oh. oh. What's that wrong? sounds good. It does sound very good. Now... Yeah. If we wanted to, what could we replace the jicama with? I already said that. What? Was I listening? No, you obviously were not. What would you think? <laughs> Something crunchy? Uh, I would say cabbage. Ew. <laughs> so ew. Ew. Like what? Think. Okay. A turnip. No. No. <laughs> no. No. How about water chestnut? Water chestnut. How about celery? celery? How about apple? Fennel. Fennel. No fennel. My no. No. Why? No. Fennel. No. <laughs> No fennel. No. What do you have against fennel? I don't want to talk about fennel. It's just because Kenny uses it. I've had a lot. a lot of therapy sessions over fennel. Let's just put it that way. Oh, look at my skewers. Now I have a bit more here, so I'm. Oops. I'm going to add this. This is a this is a wimpy one here. It's a, is that yours? <laughs> so I'm I'm going to add in the remainder of the seafood. Okay. And balance them out beautifully. <laughs> this works out to about 140 calories. Get per out. Person. Are you, you serious? Yeah. So it's totally low fat. Very low fat. Totally low fat. And totally it's delicious. it's very flavorful because of the fresh herbs. Excellent. There. Just chopping up my celery in. here. There we go. So you're just sort of doing the manual labor right I now, did. pretty much, aren't you, Look sir? At that. I'm going to add in a bit more here. Again, with my flexible board, I'm so on top of it, I simply twist and turn and put it in my bowl. There you go. Is that a good idea? Balance it off with my lemon wedge. See, we're not listening to each other right now. We're a bit no. at cross purposes, aren't we? Did I drop something? Yeah, you did. No. no. There we go. And guess where I'm going to scurry? Oh. No, I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> You're not going anywhere. Would you do me Somehow I feel I'm <laughs> staying here. Clean up after me. Okay. Uh, it's viewer mail time.
Okay. Here we go. Oh, a lovely letter. We have a viewer who's got very similar handwriting who's, who's sending us some lovely letters. Uh, I, I, no, I want to Dear do Ken it. and Mary Jo, I follow your recipes and advice religiously. My problem is that whenever I brown my, my pine nuts, I always burn them. Well, maybe he's <laughs> got them on too high. <laughs> How do you know it's a he? Because I said I saw Michael. It says kisses to Ken Michael from Brandon, Manitoba. <laughs> <laughs> do you know him? No. Because he wants you to talk about his pine nuts. No. Now, what should he do? He should lower the heat. <laughs> lower the heat. Lower the heat, Michael. Get over oh. it. Come on. And he says, uh, he says, keep up the good work and try to be nicer to each other. Never going to happen. <laughs> How can happen? Now, you know what? what? I have to tell you something. Right. I have a bit of leftovers here. Right. They're going to go in the fridge. If you, if you say you're making a stock, I'm going to have to <laughs> flatten you right now. <laughs> I'm just, I'm going to have to kill you. All right? No stock. Okay, what are you doing with going those? Going to use them for leftover Mondays. Oh, excellent idea. Hey, Very good go. idea. Yep. The, you know Tip what? Tip of the day. <laughs> Why did I say that? <laughs> I don't know. Say it. What? What's the tip of the day? Uh, what is the tip you of the day? You, you, you want to do the tip of the day, so you're going to do the tip of the day. I don't want to do it. <laughs> Please? No. Uh-oh. <laughs> okay, I'll do it. Why don't you do it? Okay, I'll do it. Just Which camera? Take a look. To, the right, it's right between camera one and one two. One pound of raw shrimp yields about eight ounce cooked. Excellent. There you go. Oh, See? you're at the height of your game. Yeah. Do you <laughs> think anybody noticed? <laughs> Nobody. <laughs> Absolutely nobody. Okay. Off to the barbecue. That looks the barbecue. really delicious, Look Kenny. Can I show the viewers? Yes, yeah, show them. Time. Look at this. Look at this. Yeah, Those, you, you know what? Those are my favorite skewers you've ever done. I'm, I'm really skewer proud. <laughs> okay. Now, how long for these babies? Probably would you say? about eight minutes at the most. Okay. On high. On high. Yes. Okay. Excellent. On they go. All right, now I'm just uh, julienning my yellow pepper here, and I've got a lovely red pepper, but if you had orange pepper or green pepper, that would be really nice. Anything you have that you like. So we're going to chop this up and get this in, our, uh, our salad. And I'm using some uh, basil, but coriander would be very delicious. Oh, you're back. I'm back. That's kind of quick, kind of unnerving. Coriander for what? For mine, if you, uh, if you didn't have basil. Oh, that's very good. Wouldn't that be good? That's very good. Okay, yeah. So? Yeah. We're doing some peppers here. Yeah. We're going to add some coriander. Yeah. We'll be right back. Oh, nice. On. That's for dinner. Okay. See you in a minute. Wrap up. You caught that, didn't you? Yeah. Hello, <laughs> and welcome back to What's for Dinner. I've just grilled up my seafood and vegetable uh, skewers. Oh, they and smell they, good, you Kenny. Know what? They're perfect. Oh, they smell really nice. Perfect. Bring them on in, baby. I am. I'm coming your way. Okay. Okay, that's good to know, I guess. In a way. <laughs> Look at your platter. Look at oh, that. Oh, sir. So nice. Now, I've got my salad, the basic composition of my salad done. Now, what I'm going to do now is my dressing, and I'm going to use a lime. You okay, baby? Yeah. <laughs> that took a lot of work. I know. It's heavy. And some basil, coconut milk, a little orange or pineapple juice, whatever you have, Can honey, and some sesame oil. Can you chop that up for me? I need the uh, big knife. No, the little knife. Mm. Oh, you, know, you can use a big one. Thank you. There you go. Okay. Put our coconut milk in. So Kenny's chopping up my basil. We'll put a little bit of our fruit juice. Give that a bit of a swirl of roux. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> and I've got some delicious honey. Oh, and Kenny, I'm going to garnish with some peanuts. Oh, perfect. So it'll be really nice, perfect. sir. Don't you think? So what is this? Uh, coconut milk. Oh. Oh, it's going to oh, be very I rich. Oh, I have to tell you. Yes. That soup you made the other day with coconut milk Did in it. Did you like it? Oh. So you're going to dig this today big oh, time. It was, it was a very popular at my house. Take my little reamer and uh, put some nice fresh lime juice because you want that uh, sharp, sharp, fresh taste. Yes. Don't you think? Yeah. Very nice chopping, sir. Do you want to load in that goes in? This? Yes. Oh, I could use a little less than pea. Okay. If you don't mind. A little S and P. Yeah. Okay. Yep. <laughs> White I want to use this. Okay. Thing. Use it. Give it a squirt. There we go. Oh, nice. About a quarter teaspoon. Yeah. Perfect. There you go. And I'm just going to pour this over my jicama salad. Oh boy. Oh, oh dear. Boy. Oh dear. Clean up. Yes. Clean up after me right now. There and we I'm going to give this a delicious stir. Oh my gosh, Kenneth. Look at that. I'm going to sprinkle my peanuts in. My nuts. Take that too, please. Thank you. Give this a stir. Oh. This is going to be good. And I'm going to put it in the appointed platter. Oh, here goes the back brace. <laughs> here we go. Look at that. Doesn't that look good? I'm going to get does. my spoon and it guide does. it in. Oh, Ken. Yummy. What did we suggest with this? 
Baked potatoes, sir. Baked potatoes. With some chives? Or, you know what you could have? No. Is that uh, Indian flatbread. Oh, that would be wouldn't nice. That, what do they call it? Non bread? Non. Oh, yes. wouldn't that be a wonderful recap yes. of it for me, sir? We have here my wonderful seafood uh, skewers yeah. with vegetable. Yes, and the delicious uh, jicama streamer salad. Oh, you know what? That's enough. Try this That's at home. Enough. It's really delicious. Try different ingredients yeah. and have some fun like we do. In the kitchen. See ya. See ya. Bye bye. bye.